let's continue to the part 2 of the types and uses of bulbs uh, knife bulbs similar to gate bulb but usually more compact open use for slurry or powd powders on and off control is used to slice through slides or severage and a gate is used for from normal positive shot to it is a gate bulb that design that is distinguished from the standard design by the use of simple metal plate for the gate and the absence of the body also called as, also called as a slice bulb um, gate knife knife kit bulb is bidirectional but designed for general industrial service application knife bulbs used for pressure tight isolation of solid mixes in water and waste water treatment plants and pumping station paper and pop plants power plants and mining industries one is they call a needle bulb yes needle bulb for accurate flow control it's a type of bulb with a small port and threaded needle shape plant it allows precise regulation of flow although it's generally only capable of relative low flow rate usually used to plumeric plumetering application especially when a constant elevation flow flow rate must be maintained for some time such as an idle fuel flow of carburetor note that the float bulb of the carburetor controlling the flow of level with the carburetor it's not the needle bulb although it is commonly described as one it is used for blunt conical needle but it is against a square edge set water sit rather than matching cone the intention here is to obtain well-defined set between two narrow mating surfaces Give, give, giving from set of, of the flow from only a light flow pressure are also commonly used to provide shot of for pressure gauge or application to shut up and supply of in its tree to the knife knives of an hydrous ammonia application since flow rates are slow and many turns of valve system stem are required to complete open or needle valves are not used in a simple shot application since the orifice is small and of course advantage of the pin treated stem is high needle valves are usually easy to shut up completely with mere finger tight pressure a spindle and a and or seat of the bulb needle bulb especially one made from brass are easily damaged by expressive turning force when shut off the flow small simple needle bulb are open use as bleed bulb in water heating heating application unlike a ball bulb with a rising steam is not easy to tell from examining the handle position whether the bulb is open or closed. Pins bulb for slurry flow regulates regulation and control. Pins bulb employ an elastic tubing slip hose and a device that directly contact the tubing body forcing the tubing together with a create a cell that is equivalent to the tubing permeability. Air operated paints bulb consists of an elasticized reinforced rubber hose 
a type of housing and two socket end cover in air operated paint bulb the rubber hoses are usually press fitted and incentered into the housing ends by the socket cover there is no additional actuator the bulb close closes as soon as there is a pressurized air supply in the body when the air supply becomes interrupted and the two volume of air exhaust the elastic rubber hose starts to open due to the forces of the process flow piston valve for regulating fluids that carry solid in suspension is a device used to control the motion of fluids along the tube or pipe by means of the linear motion of the piston within the chamber of cylinder plug valve slim valve for on and off control but with some process pressure drop are valves with cylindrical or conical tapered plugs which can be rotated inside the ball the bulb body to com control the flow through the bulb the, the plugs in a plug bulbs have one or more hollow passageways going sideways through the plug so that fluids can be flowed through the plug when the bulb is open plug bulbs are simple and open economically the next one is the solenoid bulb an electrically actuated bulb for hydraulic or pneumatic fluid control a solenoid bulb is an electronic mechanical operated bulb solenoid bulbs differ in the characteristic of the electric current they use the strength of the magnetic fields they generate the mechanism that they use to regulate the flow and the type and the characteristics of the fluid they control. The mechanism varies from linear action plunger type to regulate flow of, or use a three or more port design to switch flows between port. Multiple solenoid bulbs can be placed together in a manifold. Solenoid bulbs are the most frequently used bulb control elements in the fluids. Their tasks are to shut, shut up, release those, distribute or mix fluids. They are found in many part application areas, solenoid overpass and safe switching. Highly reliability, long service life, good medium, compatibility of the material use, low control power and compact design. Spool bulb for hydraulic control similar to the choke bulb. A spool bulb is part of the hydraulic system that directs the flow of the hydraulic fluid. The bulb is made of, of spools that rotate or slide to the black open channel in the hydraulic system. I will just end the part two of the types and uses of bulb. We will just continue in a part three of this. And before I will end, I would like to express my great appreciation to all of you for watching the video. And I would like to offer my special thanks and shout out to the channel member of Glow It Handle With Care, uh, Bicolana Española, Porcelain Care, Quinto Mosesero, uh, Glass Care, Helena Nicole, Glass Care, Renato de los Reyes, Glass Care, Michelle Mitz, Rondanon, uh, Glass Care, Home CP, Glass Care. And we have a new member, is the Batal Diaries, also a Glass Care, and Talagsik City, also a uh, Glass Care. In, wala sila sa picture pero kasi nagawa ko tong video uh, wala pa sila ngayon nakahabol sila pag edit ko so isali ko lang sila pero wala sila sa picture pasensya na sa inyong dalawa pero hindi ko kayo nakalimutan 
Okay, thank you sa lahat at sana hindi kayo magsawa sa pagsuporta sa sa mga maliit na YouTuber na tulad ko. Ito si Boss Gloitz Channel. Uh, nagpapasalamat sa inyong lahat. Bye-bye.